I thought the kids uh, came out. What we talked about early in the in the pregame was our energy, our effort, and our enthusiasm. I had to try to do that for 40. Um, we're trying to piece together minute by minute, and I think we did a good job. There's a couple minutes we can all talk about that we'd like to take back. Um, and, uh, you know, we're not here for moral victories, but the one thing I did appreciate today was their effort and focus on what we're trying to do execution-wise. Um, I just think they took us out of some of the stuff that we do, but I think, we, like Coach said, we played really hard. We tried to stop Gufferson, but obviously she got a lot of points, so that's one thing we need to work on is just executing the game plan and stopping their key scores. I don't think you need to think about like being a, them being a ranked team. I think you just need to take it as a challenge and just play your game, play as hard as you can, give all your effort, and it should be a good outcome. Yeah, I mean, rankings come and go too, so it's not something you can focus on. Um, it's just, like Ali said, just taking it, every team as a team we need to beat and doing that every time. I mean, kind of what we've just been talking about, we got to take them, treat them like any other game. Um, it's obviously we're here to win, and we're really seeking that. Um, uh, we're going to get right back into it at practice tomorrow, um, and it would be great to get some home wins, um, but we have to stay focused and not get ahead of ourselves. I think the past couple of games we've progressed a lot. Maybe the score hasn't showed or anything, but just little details that have gotten a lot better. So just have to keep doing that and do it for a full 40, as we emphasize in practice. Yeah, I think I think we're getting more consistent with our with uh, playing hard for the whole game. Um, obviously, there's still things we need to work on, but I mean, there's always going to be things to work on. But we are progressing. Can I just say one thing before? Because these guys, I know when you look at the the stat line and so forth, these guys work their tails off inside defensively, and and it, that has to be a team defensive thing. And I just think I don't want to overlook how hard both of these guys, you know. To, did to try to contain, you know, um, their inside game. I mean, there's always going to be calls every game. So, I mean, you just got to take it and just keep moving forward. Well, I, I think that what makes Iowa good is um, you can tell they play together. You can tell that there's a system. And you can tell there's a go-to kid. And, you know, we were playing and playing. And, I mean, four minutes, four points. And you see where they went? I mean, there was no mystery to it. And, uh, you know, that's a reflection. I mean, we, you know, I think the biggest stat line besides that is just we didn't get to the free throw line again. I, I am, I, I do feel like we're attacking it more. I do feel like we're um, going to the basket. Um, you know, we're just going to keep keep at it, and hopefully we get some more free points because it's that's been a, a bit of a lopsided for us. Well, that's the game right there. Um, I mean, obviously, because they have, you know, you know. That inside play, you're gonna. It's it's hard, but we we were trying to double and, and stay out of that foul trouble. And obviously, you know, it, it, that's a that's a wearing battle going on in there. And unless you've ever been down there, and I'm a point guard, so I never experienced it. Uh, that's why you have to appreciate how all the guys guys were working. I mean, we were obviously trying to double that. Uh, we broke down in the stretch a little bit. Well, we we got a board and we had the ball three down three and. Got it stolen and then came down, and that's when that foul that yeah, Allie's talking about. So you're down six. It's it's just like that, and that's the you know those little things down the, the stretch. It, you know it's you know I, it's a 13 point game, but you know I, I felt like the kids battled, and it's not really a reflection of how hard they worked and how close the game was. Well, and that's again that I mean we we chart our last two or three minutes of each quarter, and that's been something that has been a focus of us finishing quarters, finishing. And it, it, it's a breakdown like there was, you know, I know what a play that happened that we didn't do something that cost us a three. And the, what's happening now is we're recognizing what happened, not, oh, what was that? And, and I know that um, the progress is to win. And that's why these kids are talking about that. The progress is not to get close. But I think you're seeing a different team out there. And um, we just need a breakthrough, you know, a couple of breakthrough games. Well, and, no, honestly, I, I, I really appreciate what Coach Bluter said. Um, the reason I pause is she's one of the coaches I actually knew before I came to the Big Ten. Um, and she's also a person and a program that I respect. And um, I think the one thing that I like 
is that we're promoting big the Big Ten, and that she's one of the ambassadors that I really appreciate how she handles that. And so when when she says those words, that means a lot to me. Um, I'm gonna go after her, and she's gonna try to compete the same way. But I think we the respect that coaches can have for each other in the Big Ten. She's one of the uh, the people that I think that where where I where I want to be, and um, where I think she, obviously she's someone I've always expected, and I and I, I appreciate those words because. Uh, means something when another professional says that your program is is taking the right steps. Well, if it's not possible, it's not a good sign. It's got to be possible. Um, uh, yeah, I, it's 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 what we're doing here. I mean, uh, I think the thing that's hard to understand sometimes is that process and what it what it is. I mean, I I often said when I sat outside and I wasn't someone that was part of this, it seems like you should just you know magic. It is not magic. Um, the competition, how everybody works hard, the level of the Big Ten play, it's tough. Um, but, you know, that's what we're hearing. Yeah, it's going to be hard, um, and it is a process. But, you know, I see it daily. You guys may not see it necessarily on the court every day. But I see I see we're, we're daily making it. And then we want to be where those teams like, you know, that have rebuilt and be that type of team in the Big Ten. Yes, it was the right way. I mean, if you, I think just walking around and people saying our energy, our effort, our following a game plan. I mean, what are they ranked? What's the Iowa rank? 18 in the country, and it was a four-point ball game. You know, I think that – that and again, moral victories are not what we're here for. I understand. And, and I don't want anybody to be think that we're okay with what, what transpired. But um, that's the kind of competition, how competitive we want to be.